Hey there dreamers, it's Sunday night and tonight we're actually having breakfast for dinner. We're making one of our favorite meals, breakfast burritos, and we thought we'd show you how we do it. So the last time we made these, we got everything made and done and then we realized we were out of tortillas. So Jared actually suggested making Breakfast tacos, because we had tacos. corn tortillas. It was awesome, kids it loved it. It turned out so fun and so good, and you guys know how much Jared loves tacos. But first things first, we gotta wash some hands. All right, first thing we're gonna do, so we get this uh, Mexican chorizo, it's beef chorizo from Walmart. It's like a dollar for this tube, so really good I don't deal. I know if that's a good or a bad thing. I think that's a good deal. <laughs> You'll see why in a second. So what I do oh, is just kind of pop the top here. Whoa, that was a lot of pressure behind that one. And then we can just squeeze the innards out. Just like a tube of toothpaste, guys. Or oh, that was a J. Do you see that? A J or something else. A J for sure. <laughs> Let's keep it rated G, mama. <laughs> all right, Maylee is cooking our chorizo for us. She's getting it all warmed up over a medium heat. And you'll notice we used our biggest pan. This is important because this is the pan that everything is gonna get added to. Yeah. What did you, oh, it's popcorn, The taters right? are done. Sweet. <laughs> okay, if your chorizo looks like human entrails, don't you fret, this is completely normal. <laughs> okay, so we buy our sausage from Costco in the giant tube because we have a lot of humans that we feed. So we had our own sausage because the chorizo really isn't very meaty at the end of the day. It's really great flavoring, but putting the two together gives you some actual meat in your burrito while having all the awesome flavor of the chorizo. How's it going, May? That looks a lot meatier. That's good. Keep kind of chopping that sausage up. These are actually some of our favorite potatoes, and we, we made them for St. Patrick's Day a couple years ago, and we make them all the time as a side. But they're kind of fun, because you can add different seasonings and spices and stuff to make them like for a dinner or in breakfast burritos or whatever. So, cube up your potatoes, add a little bit of butter, uh, just kind of dollop it around if you wiggle it between the potatoes and put it down, it'll melt faster. And then a little salt and pepper. We really love them with rosemary if we're doing them with like a dinner or something. But they're super simple. They cook pretty fast and they're delicious. Yep, that's cooked. No, we can actually take it off the heat for a second. All right, so we can't just cook these potatoes like normal potatoes. What do we got to do? Get them all covered in butter once it melts. And then you want to put them on like a medium heat. You cover them with, we don't have a lid for this pan because it's square and it didn't make one. So we put a baby cookie sheet over it. <laughs> Chaps the heat in, let it sit for like five-ish minutes. It'll start to golden on the brown and then you can flip them and then you just wanna check them every couple of minutes until they are cooked to your desired goldenness. So you might be wondering, how do you pronounce this name? Chorizo. 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 Chorizo? Chorizo? But in Spanish, they pronounce it... Chorizo! Woo! Woo! Oh yeah, this is what we're looking for right here. Ooh, a nice golden brown. Mm -hmm. I like it. It might need a little bit longer. And now that they're getting close though, it is time to cook the eggs. Ready? Okay, ready? <laughs> Watch out, keep your hands clear! <laughs> All right, we're gonna make space for our eggs by dumping the potatoes into the chorizo. Whoa. So we do our eggs last because you want the eggs nice and tender. No one likes overcooked, dried out eggs. And with that, now that these are going, it is time to grab the griddle and start heating up tortillas. Don't be that person who warms their tortillas in the microwave. They get all soggy and they're just not good. Instead, we heat them up on the griddle here 
and it gets them nice and crispy. Into the pot. Here are the toppings that we like to put on our burritos. Sour cream, cheese, salsa, mango salsa, sriracha, Cholula, Valentina, Frank's Red Hot, Green Cholula, and a bunch of Yucateco. I think it's safe to say Jared has a salsa problem. It's true. We have eight family members and nine bottles of salsa. This is looking amazing. They just need to be all mashed together. Lieutenant Asher reporting for duty. Well, this is harder than it looks. This step is not necessary. You can actually just eat it just the way. But if you want a perfect mixture of eggs, potato, and sausage chorizo, where it's just evenly distributed all throughout, oh, it's so good. You gotta mash it. Yeah, you, you don't have wanna to choke. mash it. <laughs> all right, Mandy's gonna demonstrate making a taco for us. This is a trick Jared taught me. Sour cream goes down first, everything else sticks to it. So on some burritos, I like sour cream. On chorizo burritos, I don't. I just don't feel like, I think it loses its authenticity. So I'm just gonna go straight for the mix. Big I thought you put sour cream on first. Not on this one. You see Sleep. You got lines across your head. Hi. Do you want to come out some food? Nando. Nay. It fell out. That's not how you eat a taco. And that's definitely not how you eat a taco. Dessert. What are we making for dessert? What, what game are we gonna play tonight? If you like tacos or burritos, make sure to hit the like button. And if you like eating breakfast for dinner, tell us your favorite breakfast in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell so you get notified when we release new videos. Until next time, keep dreaming. Bye. Two steps and turn. <laughs> and then say the taters are done after I turn it. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I'm T-Rose. <laughs> T-Rose? Picking up Asher in the background, or can you not see it? <laughs> Ready, go. Okay, competition begins now. No, wait, I gotta leave. Chase! Okay. Oh yeah. No Sorry. toppings? <clears throat> no toppings, no excesses. And... Shoot. <laughs> <laughs> you wanna do that again? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's kinda funny.